The mandate will be stolen if Nigerians do not begin to protest peacefully, according to Guadamosi. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. The 2023 presidential election that produced Asiwaji Bola Ahmed Tunambu as the president-elect of the country has declared by the Independent National Electoral Commission led to the filing of the petitions against Tunambu, the All Progressive Congress and Chetima, and it has also made the political climate somewhat heated as parties now claim that they want to regain the stolen mandate. Babasinde Badamosi, who contested the party's nomination as a candidate for governor of Lagos State in 2011 and again in 2015, has once more added his voice to the subject matter of reclaiming the mandate. On his official Twitter handle, Badamosi wrote, and I quote, If Nigerians do not stand up for themselves, nobody will. The mandate will be stolen if Nigerians do not begin to peacefully protest for its restoration all over the country. Abuja and Nasser have shown that nothing will happen. Hmm. Well, um, I think some people did against this, you know, protest of a thing. You know, ever since the issue of NSAS, the way people were massacred till date, they swept those people's deaths under the carpet. They have refused to do anything concerning it. In fact, till date, some people are still saying the massacre did not happen, that nobody died. Sincerely. So that's incident. People don't want problem. I did tell you. People do not want any problem at all. They don't want to hear. We don't want to come outside with uh, justice for anybody. Justice for... So be very sincere with you. That is why a lot of people are actually calm this period. But what's next by the most and his immediate family should start the protest first and his extended family too. And that wise... In, in, that, in that way, people will believe and then take him serious. If he does that, he'll definitely get followers who share similar views and aspirations. Who is this political jumpologist who feel like talking to be relevant politically? Well, in just na news people nine carry in news sha. Let me say yes, na na news people nine go extra tweeting in talk from and it's just a uh, warm it's not even it's less than thirty seconds reach. Okay. Which mandate did you lose? Did you lose any mandate? I thought you were wise. I cannot can't see the hard rest on the wall. Tunumbu won the election free and fair. Please, I diverse. If you want to tell me, say Tunumbu is the president elect, I'm going to say no problem. But if you say Tunumbu won free and fair, it did make the thing they make my belly spoil. It did spoil belly. How will you come as I say Tunumbu won free and fair without manipulation? How? Which conscience you get? This is spitting on the corpses of people who died, who were killed during the election because of this election. Ha! Because of you, you people are attitude very desperate to come to power, different mindset and selfish interest. If you tell yourself a lie long enough, you start living the lie. We do not know how God will do it, but for the fact, but for the fact that the elections we have brought and read for, okay, but for the fact, the elections we have bought and read for, Tony Bonnie PC, of course now. The rigged will be, but will be need to show the world where they rigged them out by showing us what is passive agent, what is agent fraud the polling units created. That is the only primary evidence people can sympathize with others are the pre election issues. Of course, now there is evidence. Now there are evidences. There are evidences. You see, this social media of a thing, this phone don't make you can hardly have a secret anymore. I did tell you. Now I can fully see why your wife sent you packing from her father's company and eventually from her house. 419. How is it 419? You're right, bro. The solemn mandate needs to be protested before court and judges we rule on the matter. But the thing is, it is actually not. To me, it doesn't make sense that you have a case on court. Though the court is really dragging their leg over this issue. Remember, I've been telling us that um, I thought by now we would have gone past a lot, a lot of issues. But we're still, you know, we're still talking about it. Okay. You're right, but the stolen money needs to be protested before court and justice will rule on the rightful winner, which is will be one day this so called student Blanco will steal from other unpatriotic foolish supporters. <laughs> Who stole their property? Their noisemakers ask them to show us genuine results created by their agents. No show. If this political haste pulled by Yakubu stands, apart from affirming Nigeria's readiness to leave it with it for the next eighty, to only embolden the perpetrators to take it and not try next time. Exactly. That is that is just it. If you allow this sham of an election or shenanigan they played, now 
uh, to stay, it is going to be a calamity. And I'm not thinking now, I'm thinking tomorrow. Don't parabolate and leave Yakub alone. Bring out the results of all polling units conducted by your agent. And show the calculation that will be won. I'm sure they have that already. Please let your children and wife be in the forefront of the protest that we shall all follow. Which mandate, delusional? Uh, oh, okay, which mandate? You better wake up from your hallucination. The protest will be worse. The whole world will know that Nigerians are fed up with criminals and politics. If Ami did not take over from this criminal in Babariga, enough is enough. All the APC Agbura and thugs will collect with water. You will still be waiting for the judiciary to do the needful of returning the stolen mandate of Nigeria. The tribunal is food dragging because it is corrupt. Exactly what I've been saying. And paid by APC to delay its decision. A delay of the presidential election tribunal will favor Bola Tenumbu. Any court review of the merit of the plaintiffs would not want to disrupt the stability and security of Nigeria after Tenumbu's warning as president of Nigeria. The stolen election should never be allowed to stand. Our next choice should not be imposed on Nigerians. APC has saturated the Nigerian media space with fake news and sponsored of fake protests by fake groups. This toxic atmosphere by APC and Bola Tenumbu is designed to silence the position and is enthroned as president's election on May 29th. The presidential election tribunal can easily dispose of the technical and constitutional challenges presented in the plaintiff's petition. This is the opportunity for the Apostles' Court justices to make more money. To make money in dollars. Okay, the man is still sleeping. Let you and your family come home first. All right. Well, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, we just hope that the judges or the judicial will do what they are supposed to do. All right. Since Milan was lacking national spread and yet claiming victory, he definitely must have failed school exams. Else, it's unbelievable. All right. All right, on this note, we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen until I come your way next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.